Hello, I'm Skid from the Widescreen Gaming Forum. Today I'm playing Dark Souls 2 again. This is episode 9, I have died 25 times, and today we are going to kill the Pursuer, whether it kills me or not. It almost certainly will, but we're going to try and kill it first. Eventually. It will happen, sooner or later. So, the Pursuer is the Silver Guy. I noticed his name underneath um, his Watchmer thingy. Let's save that weapon because the last thing I need from it. Yeah. We'll save my slightly higher damage and weapon because the last thing I need from it is for it to break in the middle of that fight. You coming down? So where were my souls? Priority one, reclaim my souls. Because he has 3,000 of them. Don't lock on to him until you've reclaimed your souls. Don't sprint too much until you've reclaimed his souls. There we go, souls reclaimed. Hello there, big guy. That was not what I was trying to do. That was not at all what I was trying to do. That hurts. Not going well already. <laughs> okay. Always dodge left. I know his shield is left, but... Damn it! Well, at least my souls will be near the entrance this time. I said always dodge left, I meant always dodge right, but... Even still, that only depends on the attack he's doing. It doesn't look like you can dodge through attacks. Which means you literally have to avoid the attack. Read the direction the attack is coming from and avoid the... or dodge in the direction that... will effectively... make the attack not hit you. I also forgot to swap my weapon over, but that doesn't really matter too much. The damage difference between my main weapon and this secondary weapon is negligible against that guy. Okay, so... Greater Soul Arrow, main weapon, equip. Collect my souls, lock on and fire. Oh, you can dodge through, but you literally have to dodge right at the last second. Oh. 
Shit! Tried to dodge into the catapult and realised it was there. Ballista. Dodge into the ballista. Use the right names. My melee attack does next to no damage against him. Am I doing something wrong? Am I missing something? He's called the Pursuer. There is a hole in the wall right behind him. Am I meant to run? Is the game expecting me to run? We'll try that. There's definitely a hole in the wall behind him, but... The first time I looked at it, it looked as if that particular hole... Ouch. <laughs> the first time I looked at that hole, it looked like... There was fog inside it, so you wouldn't have been able to go through it. Okay. I've died two more times. Keep track of it this time, Nathan. 27. I'm sure you've got to do something with those ballistas, but that would require me to charge the ballista. Ouch! Yeah, there's definitely fog there, so I'm not getting through that. The blisters are going to be next to no use because I would have to trap him. Yeah, I don't have enough time to use my magic. Unless he's in the middle of a proper chain and I'm well away. Do I really just have to chip away at him? I could use that health back. Let's use another effigy, as much as I don't want to. Where are they? There they are. Rest again. And once again, the summoning signs are now all over the place. Add to my tally chart. 28. Yep. That's the game saying, having trouble? Here, have some help.
Damn it, that still hit me. That wasn't what I wanted to do. I'd appreciate it if you could really destroy some of this stuff around. That's a single attack. That's a double attack. He's gonna. He should have taken advantage of that. He failed to. When he doesn't too hit me, it's a little bit easier, but still. Sword does next to no damage to him at all. Hitting him with spells is hard. Have I killed these guys enough yet? Nope, they're still here. No, don't do that. And also, don't do that. I'm going to have no health left by the time I get to him. Okay, I have no idea how many or what time this is, but this will be my 30th death if he gets me. And I'm already half health. Already half health. My souls are going to be the other side of him, aren't they? Where are they? Shit! Excuse me? <laughs> Why didn't it roll? Time to attack me. Just out of range. Roll! 
Double damn you! Don't double tap your attack buttons unless you absolutely mean to. Bad move. Damn it. So that makes 30. I'm chipping away at him, but I'm chipping away at him with my magic. I don't... No, I already checked. I don't have a weapon that can deal excessive amounts of damage to heavily armoured people. And this weapon I've got is the one that deals the most damage. They're gone. They're gone. I don't have to fight them anymore. Okay. So I am, a, am I really going to cheese him with magic? Can't break his armor. Chipping away at him just by attacking him normally just drains my stamina. Leaves me more vulnerable. I can get two good shots, maybe a third. Should have been a good time to attack. Damn it! Damn it! Wrong button. Stamina! And again! He keeps getting me the same way. He gets me while I'm trying to heal. Thirty-one. He's killed me at least ten times now. Oh, they're gone, so I don't have to fight them anymore. I can just run straight through to my death. Okay, 
pay more attention to your stamina. Damn it, and don't multi-press that button. wasn't the healing item I wanted to use. And I paid for it! I tried using an armor piercing weapon and it did next to no damage, primarily because the weapon itself is crap. And the weapon itself isn't a broken X whatever it was, was it? No, just a mail breaker. But yeah, it does next to no damage. Suppose if you had thrust in the sword. Okay, so I only actually have three healing items this time. Damn it, I asked for that. I left myself will let myself run out of stamina again. If I have to dodge three times, I don't have the stamina to attack. God damn it! And now I'm already need to use the flask a second time. And I'm dead. No time to heal. He still has all my souls. Just check something. Yeah, that's what I thought. That's just a drop to my doom, so there's nothing of worth that way. I rolled. That time I didn't. And that time I rolled too soon. <laughs> I'm getting worse. I'm certifiably getting worse.
Almost at 35. Almost got to burn another human effigy. That door opened from the other direction. Trying to think if there's somewhere else I'm supposed to go. I mean, the blisters are tempting, but sure, but... The blisters take time to load and then fire. Unless you can get him stuck somehow, there's really no chance you can use that or the blisters effectively. And I can't spend all my time dodging, partly because I still can't get the timing right. Bad idea. I knew that was a bad idea. Why'd I do it anyway? Hmm. Maybe I should have gone with the increased armor. I want to know what the or perhaps is before I decide whether or not I want to acquire the souls. Fire long ward I just can't equip. It's a strength based weapon. I'm using dexterity based weapons for attacking. Bow is going to en encounter exactly the same problem. Yeah, the weapons I'm using is literally the best I've got. No, I will not summon help. I refuse. I'm stubborn little git like that. It's not like I can't beat him. But if I pay so much attention to dodging, I don't get the chance to attack. And then sooner or later he just gets a nice attack and takes most of my health away. Where did I die? Where are my souls? My souls are there. Oh, that was beautiful. Way to go. <sighs> what to do, what to do, what to do. That door opened from the other way. There's no other places I can explore here. could try and grind souls, but... Now, while I've still got most of my health left...
then I'll keep at him. Thirty minutes trying to kill this guy and I still can't kill him. In all probability I'm not supposed to at this point. <laughs> Oh great, my souls are behind him. Damn it. Stupid, don't do it now. No! What am I doing? I knew that would probably get me killed! No stamina left to dodge, no healing items left to heal. <laughs> he has 5,000 of my souls. I don't want to risk grinding somewhere else and losing 550,000 souls. I also keep healing the second I need to rather than the second I can. Basically the second I'm low on health I'm trying to heal rather than waiting until I've got an opening. And then of course you have the problem that those openings don't last for very long. And I don't have a way to make a better opening. Where did I die? Right in front of him. Wonderful. Again, I should have done that sooner! Oh 
Oh, for Christ's sake. He's now glowing black. He wasn't glowing black before. That's a new one. <laughs> I can't take him. I need better weapons. Okay. I need better weapons. I flat out can't take him. How the hell did you get that? Yeah, that looks safe. Oh, that's a good point. There's a door up here. It was locked. What's the betting that this is trapped and the second I open it I'm going to kill, be killed and I'm going to lose all of the souls that are with that guy. Be ready to roll. It's not trapped, thank god. That was a small leather shield and something else, a small soul I think. No. I think I need to upgrade my weapons. I think I've put that off and I think that's... So yeah, if you want that, you've got to fall off here. I'm not going to do that without the falling ring and full health. Ooh, flask shard. Small white sign soapstone. Small... Leave a summon sign. Ah. So that's how I can be summoned to somewhere else. Okay, let's collect some souls to upgrade my equipment. Uh, we can go get the shards later. Don't do something stupid and fall off here and die. No! Why did you roll that way? It fucking locked onto him and rolled around him. I wanted to roll forward. That is not fair. That is not fair at all. I was screwed over by the game mechanics. There goes 5,000 souls. 
or because he appeared behind me in the game sealed. I'll lock onto him. You're not facing him. I'm sure you want to be targeting him. Entirely unfair. Can you care tell that I don't particularly care much at the moment? I'm a bit miffed about that. That was a genuine moment where the game mechanic screwed me over. Come in here, they will drop down around about here. Where's your friend? There's two of you. This really isn't the best place to be grinding, but they're easy to kill and I want to blow off some steam. They will die. Right, let's go collect some souls that are actually worth something. Most of the ones downstairs are probably already gone. Can get back up here, can't you? Careful on my way down. Thank you. 
Let's see, there was one over there that I could get. Well, there's three over there, in fact. But there's a bunch more outside. How did you get to these? Can't climb up there. Ouch. Was it literally just a matter of dropping down here? Yeah, I think it was. Oh. Now, does this trap reset? I don't know, because last time it just... Doesn't look like it does. Incredible, really, isn't it? Such a map to be chiseled in stone. Oh, but one thing. I would not venture deep into the mansion. But I can't be certain, but I've heard disturbing noises. Something about it feels wrong. Just be careful, please. I'll be back in Majula soon. Perhaps we will meet again and discuss maps at our leisure. Right, uh, I believe the way out was this way. I would be wrong. I am not wrong, I'm just looking in the wrong direction. I've lost track of how many deaths I've done. I'm at least 36. 36? Yeah, I'm at least 36, I'm probably closer to 38. But never mind. I have full health and a flask. So let's go spring these guys in the trap room. Be a little bit more cautious about fighting them than I have been about fighting everyone else. That one shot him, I cannot complain. Ouch. close enough to get his attention. It was not. How is he almost dead? It's bizarre. Uh, there were no more enemies in there. If I go that way then there's no turning back. Oh, I can't come back anyway. Undead to call out for help to one another. A 
across the fissures between worlds. With luck, somebody will lend you a hand. So, did he just give me white soapstone? Leave summon sign. Small white soapstone. So is that a one-time use and that's a multi-use? Be summoned as a phantom to another world in order to help that world's master for a certain time. Yeah, so that's not summoning people to my world, that's being summoned to theirs. Well, we have 3,000 souls, so... Let's upgrade our equipment. See if that helps at all. Probably not. Probably still going to die and it's 50 minutes in, so <laughs> this episode will end soon after. This did not go well. That guy murdered me repeatedly. Use quick fuzz to damage hard skin foes. Effective when fighting foes in narrow spaces. Yeah, no. I was just curious. Um, so, reinforce weapons or armor. I want to reinforce that. My armour. That's a slight increase, but... Is it worth it, or should I just upgrade my weapon more? I mean, I can get the dude down to half health. And he does... yeah, he owns me really quickly, though. So I don't think a small increase in armour is going to help. Let's increase the rapier again. This will increase spell damage, so we'll upgrade this twice. Oh, that's going to use up the rest of my shards. Fair enough. That does leave me with enough to buy some shards of him, or a shard of him, but not enough to upgrade anything with it. I'll so out of interest... If you make it back. I did upgrade that one, didn't I? I wonder if the map guy's back in here. He said he was coming back soon. There's a flame on the map. Even more flames have appeared. I don't know what causes it. Did you see the flame on the map? It wasn't there when I came here before. I don't know what explains it. But there is something greatly comforting about that flame. That flame's it supposed to, to be a bonfire. Something very precious, deep within the soul. Something essential. I would not venture far into that hole. 
It was blocked by a wall, something built long ago. But it was crumbling, and I finished the job. Now a foul sound echoes within. Does it really? Did you see the flame on the map? Yes, I did. It wasn't... I don't... But I've been down there. The only thing down there was the skeleton. Skeleton is now gone. Nothing else here. So, God knows what he's talking about. Okay, so. Plan for next time. Well, I really want to see how much damage this weapon does. I will consider my souls expendable. And we'll go take on one of those big silver guys down here. So that's the bonfire I was talking about. I wonder how the hell I missed that. Yeah, figured that would get your attention. Okay, let's just remember how you attack. Heavily, of course. And now I've aggroed the other guy, wonderful. Watch it. That is not the same as resting a bonfire. <laughs> Never mind. Didn't get to check, but... I suppose I can teleport back there. I'm still under an hour, so... I have a minute to mess around. Oh, it's pointing me back here anyway. Works for me. Hello. I thought that killed him. He has a sliver of life left. I want to know how much soul he's, souls he's worth. That's definitely doing more damage to him than I was the first time I encountered them. But it, even still, I'm just not, not playing properly anymore. So he's worth about 400 souls. Damn it, he tracked me! I knew he was going to attack three times. 
He just did it. Yeah, my focus is gone. <laughs> so I'll have to count up my deaths, work out where I am. But I shall leave it there for today. So, that just leaves me to say, whoa, I didn't press that button. I did not press that button. So yeah, I'll leave it there today. Thank you very much for watching and I hope I will see you next time.